every day and every night, every night. Auntie Rosen. <laughs> this is my stepdad, Ja. <laughs> this is my mom. <laughs> and they made brunch for us to celebrate me being home. And I have a cake. That's a suitcase. It says, Welcome home. So it's been about a week into my quarantine and I just decided to like record this so that I could talk to you guys about exactly what's happening and like what it's like throughout my quarantine and stuff because I most likely I won't vlog for these two weeks because I'm just gonna use this time to spend with my family and like get reacquainted and just because like it's a as much as we spit it, it's a stressful time, you know, being in quarantine to see if you do have a virus, um, you know, and your family also being in quarantine with you, it's a selfless act and everybody does have a little anxiety and stuff like that. So I don't really want to be vlogging too much during these two weeks. I just want to like have some quiet time with them. But um, I know that for, the, for those of you who do know, I live in China and I came from China so i guess people would be expecting me to talk a little bit about my experience traveling with corona coronavirus going on and what it's been like in quarantine um so basically quarantine thing um is about like my country just making sure that i'm not carrying corona and that i won't be a risk to anyone before they re like I'm basically allowed to mingle with the public so it's a self quarantine at home like as soon as I got into the airport I went directly to Port Health I didn't even like join the line or anything I just came straight and went to Port Health I told them listen I came from China you're gonna need to do the health check you're gonna need to take down my flight number you're gonna need to um, take down my information what's gonna happen blah 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 and yeah it just went from there so now I'm in my house quarantined for two weeks because that's the incubation time of the virus so if after two weeks um, nothing happens I don't develop any symptoms I'm not ill anything like that we can safely assume I don't have corona and I will be given a health certificate and allowed to mingle with the public so that's that and um i just also wanted to clarify where my family and i were wearing masks in the in the last clip i mean it's pretty obvious why we were wearing masks but like just to reiterate yeah um even though i'm in quarantine my family is in here with me so they're still at risk you know so i um during these two weeks they will be wearing masks around me and for all intents and purposes are treating me like I, I am <laughs> patient zero so like uh, I don't mingle out in the common areas of the house a lot like I still talk to them and everything like I said this is a time for me to spend time with them as well but like I don't really go into the living room um, I have my own bathroom so that's no problem and I use my own cutlery for the time being so yeah, we're just being really cautious. It's stressful. Not World War Z stressful, but it's stressful. You know, you do have some anxiety. You do have worries and whatnot. And um, the atmosphere is just generally tense um, in terms of traveling and like wondering if a country will let you in and if you'll be allowed to come home, you know, because my ticket has been bought. And then all of this happened so I was just through I didn't even vlog while I was traveling because I was just too scared of like am I gonna make it am I gonna get home you know and actually the US stopped like I came through the US and they stopped all flights from China like 
the next day after I got into the US so I don't even have to tell you guys how stressed out I was um, so yeah I think I'm a I'm not gonna drag it out too long but like I think I'm gonna start the vlog officially officially after my quarantine is up and we know for sure that everything is okay I'm not carrying um, corona and everything is fine so yeah see you guys one eternity later okay so this is officially my first time i'm leaving the house since i got off quarantine we outside i'm on my way with my family to watch a movie my mom is stalking me she won't stop taking my pictures but at the movies <laughs> Bye. Hi. so we're out of the movie now and we're walking around the mall. I have to go get an SD card for my phone to be able to vlog properly. And we're just walking around. Hi! Hi! Hi. 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 So we're at a cafe just getting some drinks and some food. Oh, yeah. This is my first time seeing my boo boo! <laughs> So we also got some wings. This looks so good. We finished our wings and we ordered second round. I got the fuzzy navel that Dema had just now. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. The whole night I've been re thinking I'm recording and I'm not recording. She is a hot mess, okay? <laughs> I do not understand how hard it is to just press the record button, but she is just not coordinating. I don't know what's going on tonight, but anyway, we are done with the bar and off. Somewhere. <laughs> awesome. Hi, morning, guys. So, sorry, I gotta flip my hat up so you guys can see me, but I am on my way. We're gonna spend the day on a catamaran and just like sail around and catch some vibes. Can't really show you guys my swimsuit yet, but I'll start vlogging once I get there. I'll check in with you guys once I'm there. Let's just be honest. Let's just be real. You ain't got no cash. You ain't got no
now to get some sushi. Sorry, you know I got a vlog. Careful. Did it break? You're killing me there. So this is my octopus salad. And I've got chicken wings. Cause he's scared of the menu. <laughs> Our sushi just got here. As usual, that boss looks better than mine. <laughs> okay, try one, let me see. He's also struggling with the chopsticks. I think you have like the bottom one too short, that's why. What's this that you just poured? Soy sauce. Soy sauce. Mm. Tell your friends what you're having. I can't even remember. You can't um, remember? Crazy. It's, it's smoked salmon, avocado, green papaya. There's something beginning with C. It's the constitution. The constitution. Um, it's avocado, smoked salmon, green papaya, and cream cheese, I it think. It looks yummy. Yeah. Of course, mine looks better, as usual. As usual. As usual. Yeah. What do we think? It's really good. <laughs> I like how she does a thumbs up. It's actually really good. Yeah? Nice. Try mine and it's so good. I'm having like, um, I think it's salmon with cream cheese, green papaya, and what else? I can't remember right now, but it's good. Devon, what's yours? Okay, well, he's chewing right now. <laughs> but it's so good, but I actually stole one from Devon. And I'm gonna try his now. Mm. It's good. Mm -hmm. What is it? Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be like very spicy. It's really good. I can't remember. It's called a double something. A double what? Double something. I can't remember. It's we can't remember the spicy. names, but it's really good. Try the wasabi. Hmm? Wasabi and the ginger. This wasabi? Mm -hmm. Like the little mix sounds? Hot wasabi. <laughs> <laughs> and the ginger. Oh god. Wasabi is really hot. You're supposed to eat it with the thing. Sis. <laughs> this day I'm gonna be doing this. How oh, does wasabi taste? It's hot. Yeah, so I love spicy. Mm. With the ginger mine is so good. Mm -hmm. Wasabi for the first time. You're doing pretty good with your shots. You are, you are. Proud of you. Is it go with the ginger? What is um, salmon, cream cheese, cream papaya, blah, 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 blah. You don't like this one? <laughs> she doesn't like mine. But I think it tastes good. And it was really good with the ginger. I liked it with the ginger. He really did not like it. <laughs> so he was struggling a little earlier with the chopsticks, but look at him now. 
Hello? Ah, look at skeleton. You're always shopping, you're always shit. <laughs> okay, so we're just about done with the sushi. I just wanted to be known that I'm a little tipsy. And I only had like two, is two? Shameful. I had like two cocktails. Not even two, it's the simple inside there. Look at that. Shameful. Shameful. I can't hang. Are we supposed to be going for drinks after this? I. <laughs> I can't hang. <laughs> no, I'm totally embarrassed. Two cocktails. Look, my eyes shiny and everything. I get. Oh. So, would you try sushi again? Um, it wasn't bad. Mm -hmm. But I don't think it's anything that I would rush to eat. Mm -hmm. so definitely, if I was in the place, I would try it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Honest answer. <laughs> <laughs> to head out for brunch at this place called Blue Pineapple with my girlfriend Ashley and I'm excited because I haven't seen her since um look <laughs> she hiding I haven't seen her since 2018 so excited about that of course I'll catch you guys up when I'm on the road and actually heading there and yeah see you hey we just got here I can barely see the sun oh my god so, I'm gonna keep you guys posted as we head in. Say hi, Ashley! <laughs> <laughs>
boat heading to go out to the submarine. My mom is scared. Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. <laughs> Alright, so welcome aboard the Ocean Quest. We're happy to have you with us this afternoon. My name is Jeremy. I'm going to be your co pilot and narrator for this afternoon's story. In the event of any emergencies today, upstairs is Brian. He's the boat captain. He's going to be the one sailing us out to the dive site where we will find the Atlantis 15 submarine and go on our adventure today. So, of course, that means in case you were wondering, this is not your summary. This is not the sink within the next five minutes or so. Right? so you can breathe that side of relief, yes. All right, so the first thing I want to show you is the basic seamless light vest. This is the light vest on the board. Seeing some lionfish on top of the vessel as well, characterized by the striped pattern, of course, their tails and fins, which resemble some feathers or combs. Of course, there'll be a lot more to see up on the reef. We're heading up there momentarily. But this vessel, the Lord Willoughby, is one of the many documented shipwrecks we have around the island of Barbados. Of course, they're very popular.
back off the submarine. And we got our dive certificate. And a photo. So cute. <laughs>